Hi, I'm Sandy Chavez, host of Holland Fintech Live News, and in this week's News Roundup. Robinhood acquires Zigloo, UK Treasury promises stablecoins, and PayU's Latin America expansion. Robinhood reached an agreement to acquire London-based fintech app Zigloo. Currently, Zigloo offers users the ability to trade Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies from their smartphones. According to a recent statement from Robinhood, both companies share common sets of goals in reducing entry barriers for new generations of investors. In addition, this new technology will help accelerate international expansion both in the UK and across Europe. The UK Treasury launched an initial investigation into becoming a global hub for crypto. Within this plan, they promised to bring stablecoins into an existing e-money payment legislation. Previously, the Bank of England called on regulators to minimize cryptocurrency risk to financial stability. While this may be a step towards the right direction, the UK's Economic Secretary to the Treasury, John Glenn, says there is still a challenge for crypto firms to overcome in seeking to enter a world of high-quality regulation in the UK. PayU aims to strengthen its presence in Latin America as it acquires Colombian paytech Ding. PayU, who claims to be one of the biggest investors in fintech with more than $1 billion invested to date, hopes to increase the country's digital economy and provide market entry for SMEs who were previously unable to access traditional financial services. PayU also invested in Colombian firm Trenta with a recent $46 million funding. Trenta is an online platform for accounting, inventory management, and trading solutions. And last but not least, our selection of major funding rounds. Sion, a London-based startup that powers online fraud prevention, announced that it had raised $94 million in Series B funding. B2B fintech Udon secures millions in debt financing round according to the Economic Times, which includes Microsoft's contribution that has brought the firm's total debt to $225 million. Finance Keeper from Mumbai has raised around $38 million in a Series B round led by U.S. venture capital fund Qued Fund. And lastly, Amsterdam based Flow has raised 3.5 million euros in a seed investment round. And to this date, Flow has raised a total of 4.8 million euros in total. For this and much more, you can check out our website for the latest news, investments, insights, and research. Please visit hollandfintech.com slash news where you can also subscribe to our weekly newsletter. And that's it for this week's News Roundup. I'm Sandy Chavez of Holland Fintech Live and thank you so much for watching.